Hey, it's Chris Helder here, and uh, I gotta tell you, I'm so excited. I am here at the Gold Coast Convention Center, and I'm about to take the stage at the Housing Industry Association Conference. Well, this conference has been a long time in the, in the making. We are here, we are here ready to go now. Um, this is an industry, by the way, that has been through a lot of change and uh, is going through a lot of volatility, and that's why they've asked me to speak today, because I'm gonna be talking about useful belief in the post-pandemic times. And uh, really, this is about giving them tools to navigate the next phase of their business. It's gonna be awesome. I can't wait to take the stage, uh, and these are exciting. Times, the best time in the history of the world to be back doing live conferences. We're getting hit with all sorts of different things about who we're supposed to be. I mean, this thing, right? I mean, this thing tells us all the time. I mean, even like this thing makes us feel guilty all the time. This thing puts pressure on us to concentrate all the time. I mean, even now there's people in this room who are like, I'm finding this talk sort of interesting. But at the same time, I had a beautiful smashed avocado for breakfast and I posted that on Instagram. And while I'm enjoying this talk right now, I sort of feel like checking how many likes I have on my smashed avocado. Come on. Unbelievable. I'm so glad that I've met him. I actually have never heard of him before. And after today, I'll be reading his book and I'll be watching everything that he's got online. I absolutely loved Chris's energy and it gave us a really good way to look at reframing situations. I thought Chris's presentation was really energetic. Um, it was a combination of entertaining and uh, educational at the same time. I really enjoyed it. I had this guy come up to me recently. He said, Chris, I gotta be honest with you. He goes, I'm having a hard time right now. I'm 55 years old. I just got a divorce. My wife left me and I'm broke. I'm 55 and I'm broke. And I'm like, fantastic. It's the best time in the history of the world to be 55 and broke. I mean, can you imagine being 55 and broke in 1929? The only job you didn't be able to get is like shoveling coal. I mean, are you kidding me? There were no jobs available in 1929. That's it. You'd have four more years to live on the planet. You're 55 today. You got 44 more years to live on the planet. Pull yourself together and make something happen. Now, here we are facing even probably greater challenges in this room, particularly. Today's the day for us to draw a line in the sand. Be good to yourself. This is your shot. This is it. How you handle this will define where we go from here. She is unbelievable. He's a life changer. Really engaging. It was entertaining. He's quite infectious and can really bring a room's energy up. 